Help! Someone help! I don't know what to do. Good morning everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 11. There's the tree. I'm stood up, I'm off the sofa, feeling festive. I just kicked my leg but you didn't see it. Whew! Um, you don't care. I just edited yesterday's vlog, it was a lot of me sitting. Um, so I apologise for that, today will be less of that. Because I actually have stuff to do, kill surprise. Um, orders need to be packaged, sock sets need to be made into sock sets and not just sock yarn with the massive skein that I need to make into a mini skein. And I need to do yet more beading and are you surprised I got out of bed late again? I woke up wide awake, Mario left, and I was like, yes, this is the best thing ever. Then I fell back to sleep. And then I had a dream, and then I heard someone like shouting my name. And so then I woke up, and then I still heard someone shouting my name, and then I woke up again. So that was really terrifying. I woke up thinking someone had broken into my house, but no, it was just my brain. Like, it was, I could hear it, it was real. It wasn't real, there was no one there. But I'm going to make myself my ice cream matcha. It's a matcha kind of morning. Mary bought milk. Lots of M's in that sentence. Yeah. iced matcha latte. Realised you don't have ice, so I have a lukewarm matcha latte, which is less desirable. Oh, but still quite tasty. Mmm, yeah, I can get on board with that. Right. Let's make these sock sets into sock sets. So I was just distracting myself from packaging and I think I found an extensive fade in my yarns because I'm thinking this one is fun, this one is fun, if not take this one out, these together for a so faded sweater maybe or take that one out and put that one in, maybe that works better, I don't know. Or maybe just take them both out and put this one in. I've wanted to make a so faded sweater for a while, just because it's fun. But all of the ones that I have have only got three skeins. And I think, at the size I currently am, I might need four. But this is four. So this is Winter Wolf. It's got the speckles. This is um, Winter Elf. No, it's not. This is Winter Sprite, sorry. This is Music Is My Weapon. This is Ice Dragon Wormling. This one, if I'm putting it in, is Mero. And that one looks quite nice, if not. This one is Blue Mage. I'm just scaling it up so it's not as tidy as the others. No, I think it does need this one, if I'm doing it. Or, I could take that one out. No. Or, I could take that one out and put this one in. Ah, oh, maybe that's better. I don't know. It just... It just it's quite fun, you know? Quite fun. Ooh, fluff everywhere. I found another option. This one is Fairy Fire. I think it goes better. I think it fades better.
Oh, but they do fade really nice. I mean, these all fade nicely together. Am I just being ridiculous? There is a fade here, I know. I just can't see what colour would be best. That one. Do I make a five fade and do something else and not a jumper? Help! Someone help! I don't know what to do. Ooh. There we go. Um, orders have been packaged. They're ready to go. I have to go to the post box and the post office because some are massive. So thank you very much. I'm a little in shock. Um, wasn't expecting someone to place a 12 skein order. So thanks. But I had to label all of these as well. So not all of them. The ones that I dyed and hadn't labeled yet, I had to label them. But please let me know what you think my fade should be. B, and if I should make the fit so fade as well, like, I'm so aware that th those yarns match my hair. Hopefully by the time I finish my hair will be a different colour, so um, I'm not too worried about that. But yeah, I don't know whether to make a so faded sweater or make a shawl with a fade. I want to make more garments though, because um, I don't make many jumpers, because um, I don't like to admit what size I am, which is just me getting deep and real with you um but yes that's why I don't knit many jumpers don't like to admit my true size but that metal Christmas um Spotify playlist is like the best thing ever I've been jamming out to it in my room while packaging orders much more efficient than trying to watch some kind of show so when time is it now 10 past one. Oh, it's so late I still got beading to do and there's house to look round and makeup to put on. No complaining, just doing. Come on, Hannah, get a grip. Orders have been packaged and sent. So if you ordered something from me, it's on its way to you, and there's nothing else I can do about it. Yeah. But a couple of people suggest me uh, do a medley of my jingles. Now, that would be quite a lot of work. But I'm not saying no. We shall see. But um, enough of that chit chat. I'm going to get myself a drink before I am quite thirsty and start beading, even though I started a little bit earlier, but not properly. So I kind of need to just really get on it quite a lot. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's get beading. Let's do this. This is a terrible angle, but my tripod's upstairs. I should make one for the first time in two days. I've gone blue to match my hair and jumper, and it's kind of all over my face, but when you put your glasses on, you can't tell. But it's time to open the bird and blend advent calendar for day 11. I'm trying to change up the tune of the jingle. It's not going too successfully. I haven't seen any spoilers for today. So, I don't know what it is. I'm quite excited. Ooh, smoky Russian. Don't really like, don't usually like smoky teas. But I'm excited to give this one a go. Lapsang lovers will enjoy warm campfire aromas with this pinewood smoked black tea. Our take on the ancient Russian caravan blend. Um, an ancient full bodied blend featuring pinewood smoked lapsang souchon. Uh, it's got oolong tea, lapsang souchon tea, and malfeng kimun tea. Pronunciations. My forte. Maybe I'll have this tomorrow morning. Let's see what it's like. Or when I get back from looking around this house. Um, but Mary was due back. Any second. He just came through the door. Just as I said, Mary will be back any second. It was like it was rehearsed. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Christmas is here. Bringing us cheer. Dee -dee -dee -dee. But yes, um, and then we're gonna go and look around this house and then I'm going to go to Mark Cross and sing some Christmas carols. 
Alright, I'm gonna, gonna talk to Mary now. Bye. The bad angle's back, but Mary is here with me this time. You can't jiggle too much because this is a very precariously balanced. We're gonna open our advent calendars. For those who haven't watched before, Mary makes me an advent calendar. He puts something nice in his tin every day. Don't you, my angel? Yes. Right, are you going first? Yeah. Okay, it's 11. And Mary has a cheese advent calendar because I'm less romantic. I don't know, some say cheese is the most romantic food. Mary does love cheese. I mean, the French eat cheese, and they're meant to be quite romantic. Win! No, no joke. I'm disappointed. You make a calendar for a friend. I don't know what I'm Yarsberg! Yarsberg! Better refrigerator. Cheese! Yeah, you can put it in the fridge. Yeah. We, did, we established yesterday that Maria's Yarsberg from a couple of days ago would have been better in the fridge because it's a bit melty. You can open yours. Oh, thanks for your permission. Oh, my, so many cheeses to eat. What is this? It's because you. This is a higher. Mm. It's not as flat as it usually is. Mm. Collection coming. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> a tiny thing of cereal. I know. I <laughs> That's so funny. I do like cereal. Breakfast provided. A tiny portion of cocoa pops. I provide for you. And a stamp of a pig in a book. Pig in a book. Hide Mary's face and mine. And focus on the pig in a book. Okay, there we go. We got there. We got there. Thank you, my angel. Where is it? For my cereal. <laughs> I love cocoa pops. I haven't had them in years. My sister used to have them every morning before school. That was a bit from your old mitten. Careful. My phone cable's there. Yeah, right, in a bit. Good evening. So I'm now home. I could put the big light on, but I can't be bothered. I've just been stood up for quite a long time carol singing, and then I had to wait in the cold for ages for the bus. Oh, my life is such suffering. It's not, I'm being overdramatic. Um, carol singing was good. It wasn't as good as it has been in previous years, but the man who usually runs it didn't go because I th he's recently had a baby. So, well, his partner's recently had a baby. Well, I guess he kind of has two. So he, d he wasn't doing it, somebody else was. And they just weren't as charismatic and it was just a bit more chaotic but that's okay um the pianist played the carols down a couple of tones which was very nice for me because i like to sing a desk camp i technically shouldn't because i'm probably damaging my voice but it's only once a year um <coughs> but um yeah I th i'm definitely an alto that can sometimes sing high notes for a short spell if that makes sense. But I had a lot of fun. I met up with one of my friends that I used to work with and uh, someone that works there now. So they both still work there, but I only worked with one of them um, at the bead shop. And they're both really lovely. So we went and got pizza and we had a couple of mulled wines while singing Christmas carols. Do you know what? 
that's a great way to spend a Tuesday evening. But, oh, the house that we looked around was nice. Um, it's the first one we've looked around, so we're probably not going to take it. I'm just going to be very relaxed about it and whatnot. And yeah, it's been a good day. I realised I haven't had a warm cup of tea all day. I had that matcha this morning and then that's all I've had. Which is quite unlike me. I've just downed a large glass of orange squash so I'm quite like gurgly, I apologise. But um, today has been a good day. Hasn't been as productive as I wanted it to be. But I'm hoping tomorrow is more productive because otherwise I'm going to have no stitch markers to put in the shop. <laughs> oh no. I didn't mean for this to happen. It just did. But um, I actually feel really tired. Can you tell? I don't know if I look tired. You can't tell because of the glare on my glasses. Um, <clears throat> but yes. Carol singing was fun. Spending time with friends was fun. I could rest my elbow on here and it might be nicer. Um, and I've just been sitting for a hot minute and chilling out while casually drinking a glass of squash. So I bought some sewing, so the little doll that I have, I bought some sewing patterns for her. Um, and I didn't know what fabric to use, so I did some googling. They suggested underwear fabric. Now, I felt a bit weird going into a shop and buying these. But this is like underwear for... I got 11 to 12 year olds because the fab the fabric was much more feminine and nice and cute for her. But they suggested underwear because uh, generally underwear fabric doesn't fray and <clears throat> tends to have quite small patterns on it and when you're sewing for something so small you want quite small patterns. So I got these are just pink pants which it feels so weird to show but I'm going to use them as fabric if it's not for any like weird reason. That's the wrong thing. Uh, what's this? There we go. And then I bought some Christmas vests for ages <clears throat> six to seven. Because I thought they might make quite cute leggings. But I don't know if they'll work. But <clears throat> it was cheap. Because cotton will fray. So I can't really use cotton. And underwear fabric. It's usually quite thin. Which is what you need when you're sewing for something so small. So that's that. So maybe I'll treat myself next week before I go down to uh, Mum and Dad's for Christmas. I might sew little Lola some clothes. So she can have a little Christmas wardrobe, that'll be sweet. Or I can do it on Sunday maybe. We shall see. But yes, just thought I'd share. I also got my Kickstarter prize from uh, the beach shop. It's a bag and a badge. I'll show you it in full detail tomorrow because I haven't got it out yet. But yeah. My friend Emma gave it to me because she picked it up for me. Um, she works there, which makes sense. Right. I should probably go to bed. Because I am quite tired and have talked to you enough today. But yes. Please let me know about that so faded jumper. I had a look at the pattern when I was on the bus in the way into town. It's a five colour jumper. So I'm thinking Winter Wolf winter sprite i can't remember what comes next winter wolf winter sprite maybe music is my weapon ice dragon wormling and then marrow on the end but fairy fire looks so good in it as well so unless i take out music is my weapon and put in fairy fire in its place that might be a fair shout i've taken the skeins offline just in case so people can't buy them but please help. Please. I need to lay them all out again and have another look at them. Now I know it's a five colour jumper. I thought it was four that I needed. It is not, it is five. Um, but yeah. I want to knit a larger size than I am and then have it nice, big and slouchy. That might be nice. Because I tend to favour my slouchy jumpers more, which is weird. Because I love the look of a negative ease jumper. I just don't love the look of a negative jumper on me. Negative ease jumper on me. I have more tummy than I would like at the moment. Mince pies are happening. That's what that is. But that's okay. Because New Year soon. And no more mince pies. And then trying to lose some of the tummy before the wedding. 
Right, I'm off. I'm really good at talking in circles. Before I start talking another one, I'm gonna close out the vlog and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>